Hey guys, welcome back to the AWS Cloud Demos. My name is Murli and I am a AWS Solution Architect. And so in today's demo, we will look into how we deploy a single page application made with React. Uh, we will deploy that application into AWS Amplify. Uh, let's jump right into the demo. Um, so I've logged into my console already. Oh, okay, um, so I'm going to click on AWS Amplify uh, right here. Okay, when you're on the AWS Amplify screen, uh, you can see there are a couple of instructions. It's 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 pretty easy to get started, all right? And so you can also go ahead and watch this video um, for the fastest and easiest way to uh, deploy an app. And also, uh, if you scroll down bottom, uh, right, you can also connect your repositories like GitHub or Bitbucket, wherever your app is hosted. Um, you can just simply connect it to your repository and then push your code and deploy it in your AWS Amplify. Right, um, you can also scale uh, your applications very well. Um, so in this demo, we will look into how we uh, host uh, the web app. Right, so we are not building an app; we are just hosting a web app, uh, which is uh, based of Re uh, React. Okay, but you can also do it with uh, other uh, frameworks like Vue, uh, Vue.js, and and um, uh, vanilla JavaScript app. So uh, in this demo, we will look into uh, deploying a Next.js application right um, so for that reason what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, go to my code sandbox uh, you can also go to the uh, code sandbox .io. I'm just quickly creating a dummy uh, a blank starter next JS app okay um, which is a single page application so uh, once you're logged in into your uh, code sandbox I'm just going to create a um, application from a template I've clicked on the template now I've seen this screen I can see the next JS. I can also deploy a view or react or it, it's up to you it's totally up to you but in a, in my case I'm choosing next JS. so I'm gonna click on next JS like so so it will create a starter project and you will be able to see the uh, app which is running right and um, so in, in our case I've already uh, uh, created a application and now if I go back to the um, application I don't know if this is running but you can close this or and then you can simply run dev which will uh, spin up your app um, in our case I, I don't I don't know why I'm not able to see here but let's deploy this app I've created this app and I'm going to, I'm going to uh, connect this repository uh, connect this sample application to my github account okay and uh, so click on this uh, icon here and then create repository so I would like to name this as Goofy. Yeah, it's okay. It's a random name. So just go ahead and choose it. And I'm going to set it to private create repository. This is all just done on Code Sandbox. Okay, so but uh, don't think that uh, this can only be done in Code Sandboxes. You, you can deploy any application in your local and then uh, you can connect it to the github repository and then from aws amplify you can connect to your repository all right um so now that i just wanted to uh, you know uh, show you how uh, a github can be connect github repository can be connected to your uh, uh, aws amplify all right um so okay uh, we have looks like our application is running and this is a starter page the next JS app uh, if you want to see how it looks just click on this uh, icon and that will load the page all right um there you go so this is a startup project and also there will be a startup api which is something like api slash hello you will see some json data so there you go uh, this is a sample json data on this api so we will now deploy this into our aws amplifier okay so go, go back to the console like so and then uh, check your code sandbox I think looks like everything is ready and now go to AWS Amplify console click on host your web app get started click on github continue and once you load the page select the repository so these are my previous uh, applications so what I'm going to do is click on this view github it's not opening in a new tab that's fine uh, uh, I've logged into my account I can see um, I have to give uh, the repository access. I, I'm choosing a specific um, access to my AWS Amplify uh, specific repositories because I don't want to give all repositories. So maybe you can do uh, the same thing for you as well. Uh, our repository name is Goofy blah 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 and that's the one. Select one. I So I've given a permission to this application uh, and then click on save. And in a new tab, go to um, on the new tab go to your console again 
sign in, sign in back to the console. There you go. Click on Amplify. And now click on GitHub. And once you lo uh, load on this page, right? Once once you are on this page, uh, just click refresh, and then you should be able to see your uh, application uh, that you have given the access. All right. Select that. Once you select the repository, uh, and make sure that uh, the branch that you want to deploy, right? Um, so in my case, it is main branch, and then go ahead and click on next. And you will see, uh, there, these are the build and test settings. Um, you can see the pre-build commands, npm, ci, npm run build. Uh, so whoever is working on uh, single page applications, uh, you, you should be able to understand all this uh, and you should be able to edit um, in case of you have any custom commands other than build or pre-build if you want to run something else, you should be able to give it here, right? Uh, you can always edit it uh, like so and um, uh, let's go ahead in our case I'm not editing anything I just wanted to leave this because it is a startup project but in your case it might be different okay um, I'm gonna create a new IM role and use the services role and click on next and this is my review screen I can see uh, what I'm doing here is repository I have given github and main branch I have app name build image so everything is great and the framework is next year server side rendering which is a single page app and then we will click on save and deploy like so all right we are now on this goofy um, application uh, we have um, we we are trying to provision the uh, environment for this particular app right uh, so that's going to provision the app and also it builds and deploys and once you once you see everything green everything green ticks over here then um, your app will be ready to uh, View all right. So now with that, now now that we have finished the provision step, we will be able to finish the build and deploy step in a couple of minutes, and then we will look into the app. So there you go. Uh, now that you have um, finished the deploy step, as well, uh, now you can see um, this link over here on the left side. Uh, so just go ahead and click on it, and it will open in a new window, new tab. Sorry. And there you go. Now your app is being deployed uh, to a Amplify app. As you can see and also you should be able to access your API as well um, there you go now um, you have now deployed an app and you can see the API is also working fine on our AWS uh, amplify so this is our example uh, single page application but in your case you can deploy your own apps just connect your um, repository github repository to the uh, AWS amplify it will start importing the project and you can also build and also make sure that you can edit the uh, build flow if you want um, if it is if you want to customize it a bit further there you go uh, this is a single page app we have deployed to the amplify app right um, and then uh, and that's it guys thank you so much for watching the video and please like uh, the video please share subscribe and thank you for watching and i will see you guys in the next video